And as you see, I'm going all the way through her scalp and I'm scraping it. Hair Fairies technician Renee Wilson demonstrates how to knit comb hair for lice. She works at a salon dedicated to removing the bugs. We get a lot of cases where the um, parents have used the over the counter and they come here and their scalp is either raw from the chemicals or the child is allergic to one of those chemicals. Over the counter treatments don't just pose an allergy risk. Lice are showing resistance to them. Doctors now recommend skipping over the counter remedies. Lice are like anything else, uh, any other form of life in that they want to continue their life so they could evolve ways of getting around treatments we have to get rid of them. Dr. Scott Goldstein says every time child is different, but prescription medications are now the best line of treatment. So over the counter treatments have become less and less effective in certain parts of the country, including Chicago. Um, so we recommend they're fine to try, but in general, they're not very effective anymore. Companies like Hair Fairies are catching on. Even better, many of their services are covered by health insurance. Preventative measures are key, like keeping children's hair up in a braid or a bun, keeping styles short, or checking your child's scalp weekly. Head lice don't jump, hop, or fly, they crawl.